Lots of texture happening, dimensions. So what you want to maybe do is start adding in those more details, but they probably need to dry first. Mm -hmm. Don't obsess with the first layer being perfect and those you'll start being able to really make that color and really go ahead and add the detail work to it. The San Mateo County Office of Education put out a call to student artists across the county to submit their ideas on what a mural representing the diversity and support of our community could look like. Then those student artists were also invited to help pitch in on the final design of the mural as well as the painting process once the design part was finished. We're honoring former Congresswoman Jackie Spear and former Supervisor Don Horsley with the mural. Jackie and Don both retired in 2022. Both Jackie and Don are longtime, very respected leaders in the community. What they most care about is the happiness and well-being of children. Well, a safe and supportive community is one where we can walk without fear. Uh, we can drive without fear. In 2013, there was a national tragedy at Sandy Hook Elementary School where 20 first graders and kindergartners were killed by violent gunfire. That tragedy galvanized in San Mateo County among all the elected leaders a commitment to do something so that we don't witness another new town. The Coalition for Safe Schools and Communities is a group of cross-agency leaders who bring their personal leadership skills and the resources of their agencies to a central place where we focus on safety and wellness for the children and youth in San Mateo County. I feel like if students don't have access to a safe and supportive environment in a school, they'll feel like lonely, lost, and generally just make an experience that determines most of their life until they're like an adult so much harder. I feel like a diverse place is inclusive because you know people from all different walks of life and cultures get to like intermingle and just unify, and that's why I really like my school at Jefferson. We wrote the words out, we love our community. We included a lot of flags that we see around our community. And from the land, we kind of made the butterflies like lean on to make it seem like they're migrating, so to represent like the immigrants in our country. There aren't many expressive methods like art and mural where people can actively, like actually be represented. I think the beautiful thing about the mural is that it really reflects children's hopes and dreams. They continue to inspire us and remind us about what they think is possible.